M0FXB. Welcome to my channel, Digital Ham Radio Diary. FXB, I thought I'd give you an idea of how hams are using their mobile phones these days for ham radio and uh, also just normal communication hobby. So let's do one at a time. So we've got Zello here. Now Zello is a free app. You can download it. It's not all ham channels, but the group of channels I use is owned by G1YPQ. And that's got hams and uh, radio enthusiasts uh, mixed together there. So that's one I use. I'll put links in the description for how to connect to, to Zello. So let's uh, back out of that. The next one we've got is Droid Star, which is connecting you to D-Star, um, YSF and DMR, plus other modes. And that works great. Let's see if we can just connect in now, just give it a test. Yeah, there's no one talking now, although we are connected to Talk Group 91. Let's turn it up. This is Kilo Echo 8 Sierra Uniform Oscar. Again, it's a free app. And you do need a ham license for that one. Uh, you need your DMR number. And there's different modes here. If you tap the drop down menu here, if I can do it. I can't do it at the moment, but anyway, it's YSF, DMR, Fusion, P25, NXDN, all that kind of stuff. So disconnect, see if it allows me, there, there you are, there's the different drop-down sections there. Going all the way down, NXDN, reflectors, XRF, DCS, I mean, it's just such an amazing app. You do need to add a vocoder in settings, which is vocoder, look for the line that says vocoder, down here, which you get, which I'll put a link in the description for a vocoder. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Echolink. I think many hams have heard of Echolink. That connects you to repeaters, gateways, and individual users worldwide. You've got locations all around the world. Like so, here's United Kingdom. And if we try and connect to, so you normally go to Hubnet, which is M0FXB. Sorry, M0HOY, there you go. Add to favorites, then connect. And we can talk to that person. If you buy a, a device that has a PTT, you can even have a PTT on these. But there's, uh, as you can see, that's working great. The other handy thing about, uh, what, uh, this is an Android 9. Sorry about the flicker there. This is Android 9. Um, you can actually run two at a time. I'll show you that in a sec. So let's just quickly show you, you've got QRZ for looking up the ham radio database, PiStar to connect to your hotspot just for control purposes. I like to use another one called GPS Tester, you get all the satellites. There you go, and when there's a fix, you know, a lock, they, all the satellites will show up. Uh, Peanut, which is another made by PA7LIM, I know it's showing it horizontal, so you log in, you have to get your peanut um, sort of activation code from PA7LIM, again link in description, um, peanut English and again you on air, let's log off, so come out of that, now I'll just show you how you can run two at a time, so we go tap this square at the bottom, no, the, the three lines actually. Tap the three lines. Let's move this out of the way. Three lines here. And this is just an old Android phone that I've got. Um, move. The, let's just move one of them up. Let's move Droid Star up like so. So tap this little um, Droid Star thing here. Hold it. Go up. Uh, and then it's on. Oh, it says open in split window. Tap that. And at the moment, it's right at the top. Then tap say Zello at the bottom. So now we've got Zello, and we can PTT, tell me off for keying, but look, there you go. And we go back to main, we can connect, we're now connected to, um, let's turn it up. So we've got Droid Star and Zello working at the same time, and we can change you know, we can change to other ones. So you put peanut there, look, log in. 
Yeah, you know, it looks like it won't, it won't let you. Oh, it is letting me TX. So it's pretty good, isn't it? So let's disconnect. It's basically, I'll call this video ham radio on your mobile phone. This is a Galaxy 8. There's many, many more apps you can use, but these are the ones I use. Uh, Android 8 Plus. Um, Galaxy Android 8 Plus. So give it a go. And then obviously you can get a network radio and that'll be a separate video altogether. 7.3. All the best. Perfect speed. Just uh, setting up Echolink on W5 network radio. So obviously you go to the Play Store and download the app. I'm going to show you my settings. First thing you want to do is kill Zello though because it will keep coming to the foreground when you push the PTT. So go to Settings. Scroll up to Apps. Then go to Zello. And you want to select Force Stop. Then go back to your home screen and select Echo Link. Also, you've got to log in with your account. You need a ham license to use Echo Link. Now I'll show you my uh, settings. You just tap your three dots here, settings. So my call sign, scroll up. My gain is at plus six dB. Audio stream it says voice call. We're gonna test that. Keep going up, everything else looks the same. External PTT button. I got a feeling though that really when where it says voice call, if you want the volume to work, you need to set music. Okay. Let's just go back and then we'll log in. We'll log into the echo test. So let's go to, I think I've got it on favorites, echo test, and then we'll connect. Now let's do a transmit. M0 FXB test, M0 FXB test. Tap the screen for now. Okay, let's try the PTT. It's not working, let's double check why. So we'll go back into settings. We'll go up and it says PTT button, select that and then you wanna tick the one that says PTT button, use device PTT button, if any. There you go, we've ticked that. now. It won't work on every device, but let's push the PTT. There you go, so hold it down. M0 FXB test, let go. And let's test the volume as well. M0 FXB test. Yeah, I'll do a longer one. M0 FXB test, one, two, three, four, five. M0 FXB test, one, two, three, four, five. You can see the volume's working and the PTT works. And what we're gonna do is go to settings and show you one last time. Call sign, relay, plus six dB, music, um, app sound, PTT, just tap it and you've got to tick the second box down. And then everything on Echolink will work. Let's try and connect to one of my favorites. No, it's not going to let me. Probably got to disconnect maybe from the other one. Audio test, echo test. It's going to sign out. Go yes. Then we'll sign back in. This time we'll click M0HOY, connect. Right, it's working now. Just... But uh, you're in the Soviet Union was absolutely different, believe me. So um, I remember 
I was aged out 11 years. There you go, it's working fine. Now, if you want to find all the stations, what you've got to do is go here, the third one along, go to locations, scroll all the way up for UK. Actually, Europe is here, then you scroll up, United Kingdom, choose the one you like. And then if it's available, you can either add it to favorites, like so, or click connect. And it will connect if that station allows. It looks like it's not going to allow, but that's okay. Go back out. Now, if you want to look at your favorites, you just tap the last bit and look, there's favorites that we've added. So I hope this helps you set up your W5 network radio with Echolink 73. Please like and subscribe my channel. All the best.